Sosnet Anti-Aircraft The Sosnet Anti-Aircraft Missile System, also known as 9M337 Sosna R, is a state-of-the-art missile system developed by the Russian Federation. In service since May 2019, it was designed by KB Takmash as a successor to the 9K35 Strela 10. The Sosna SAM is engineered to protect military units from air attacks in all types of combat situations, including during March. The missile boasts an operational range of 10 kilometers and a flight altitude of 5 kilometers, reaching a maximum speed of Mach 2.6. It uses a laser guidance and radio guidance system and is equipped with a fragmented rod warhead and an AP frag warhead. The system is highly resistant to jamming and is fully unified with the Palma ship missile and artillery system by its main structural elements. This makes the Sosna SAM a significant development in the field of air defense systems. Convair Model 49 The Convair Model 49 was an ambitious proposal for a transforming, heavily armed, fire support aircraft for the U.S. Army. Developed by Convair San Diego Division, it was designed to be versatile, rugged, and quick to deploy, with the ability to loiter or hover above the battle zone ready for action. The propulsion system consisted of three shroud-mounted Lycoming LTC-4B11 turboshaft engines, coupled through clutches, shafting, and gear reduction units to contra-rotating variable pitch rotors within the shroud. The Model 49 was heavily armed, with modular armaments that could include two side turrets with XM134 7.62mm machine guns or XM75 40mm grenade launchers and a center turret fitted with either a rocket launcher with 500 WASP rockets or another 30mm cannon. Despite its innovative design and capabilities, the Convair Model 49 was never produced, losing out to the Lockheed AH-56A Cheyenne, which was later replaced by the well-known AH-64 Apache. Inca's Hudson Recon APC a formidable armored vehicle engineered for the most demanding military and security operations. With its high-grade armor materials, the Hudson Recon provides unparalleled protection against ballistic threats, ensuring the safety of personnel in any environment. Designed for both on-road and off-road mobility, this APC offers exceptional maneuverability, allowing it to navigate diverse terrains with ease. Its spacious interior accommodates a driver, co-driver, and multiple passengers, making it an ideal choice for transporting troops safely to and from mission locations. Equipped with tactical features like roof hatches and communication systems, the Hudson Recon can be customized to meet the specific needs of various customers, from military forces to law enforcement agencies. Discover the ultimate combination of protection, mobility, and tactical effectiveness with the Inca's Hudson Recon APC. US Navy Sea Hunter The Sea Hunter is an autonomous unmanned surface vehicle launched in 2016 as part of the DARPA Anti-Submarine Warfare Continuous Trail Unmanned Vessel Program. This 132-foot-long vessel, with a displacement of 135 tons, is powered by two diesel engines, allowing it to reach speeds of 27 knots. The Sea Hunter is designed for endurance, capable of operating for 30 to 90 days without resupply and covering a range of 10,000 nautical miles. Its mission is to use sonar and other sensors to locate mines and even the quietest enemy submarines. The high-frequency sonar can send acoustic pings into the ocean before analyzing the return signal to determine the shape, size, speed, and characteristics of any undersea enemy activity. Despite its advanced capabilities, the Sea Hunter carries no crew or armament, showcasing the potential future of naval warfare. The Roadrunner by Enduril, a groundbreaking advancement in the world of defense technology. Imagine a sleek and powerful unmanned ground vehicle designed to tackle the most challenging environments with precision and efficiency. 
The Roadrunner combine state-of-the-art sensors, artificial intelligence, and autonomous capabilities to deliver unparalleled situational awareness and agility on the battlefield. With its rugged design and advanced mobility features, this unmanned vehicle can navigate rough terrain and hazardous conditions with ease, providing support and protection to troops in the field. Equipped with cutting-edge defensive systems, the Roadrunner represents the future of defense innovation, ensuring a safer and more secure world for all. Join us as we unveil the next generation of ground-based defense technology with Enduro's Roadrunner, where strength meets intelligence and security knows no bounds. Nimitz-class aircraft carrier the Nimitz-class aircraft carrier is a class of 10 nuclear-powered aircraft carriers serving the United States Navy. Named after World War II Pacific Fleet Commander, Fleet Admiral Chester W. Nimitz, these carriers are some of the largest warships ever built. With a displacement of 100,000 to 104,600 long tons when fully loaded, these carriers measure 1,092 feet in overall length. They are powered by two Westinghouse A4W nuclear reactors, allowing them to reach speeds over 30 knots and giving them an unlimited range. The Nimitz-class carriers can accommodate a crew of over 6,000 and carry 85 to 90 fixed-wing aircraft and helicopters. Their armament includes multiple MK-29 guided missile launching systems, RIM-162 ESSM or RIM-7C Sparrow missiles, and Phalanx CIWS. These carriers were the largest warships in service until the introduction of the USS Gerald R. Ford in 2017. Hisaro The Hisaro is a medium-range air defense missile system developed by Turkish companies Aselsan and Roketsan. It's designed to protect military bases, troops, ports, and other national strategic assets against aerial threats flying at medium altitudes. The system can defend against a variety of airborne threats, including combat aircraft, cruise missiles, helicopters, and unmanned aerial vehicles. The Hisaro missile system uses a dual-pulse solid propellant engine and has an operational range of 25 kilometers. The missile features a modular design and can be vertically launched. It can perform missions autonomously using a medium-altitude 3D search radar or operate as part of a battery using a fire control unit. The missile launcher unit is mounted at the rear of a Mercedes-Benz Zetro's 6x6 military truck chassis. The Hisaro missile system is very similar to the Hisare family, but the dimensions of the missile are bigger and the range is improved. This innovative missile system represents a significant advancement in military technology. In 1992, a significant incident occurred in the depths of the ocean when a Russian Sierra-class nuclear submarine collided with the USS Baton Rouge, a Los Angeles-class nuclear-powered attack submarine from the United States. This event took place near the Russian naval base at Severomorsk, about 12 miles from the shore. The 9,000-ton Russian submarine struck the USS Baton Rouge as it was preparing to surface. Both submarines sustained damage in the collision, with the American boat receiving heavy scratches and a torn ballast tank. Despite the severity of the collision, there were no casualties. The USS Baton Rouge was on an intelligence-gathering mission and had reportedly been trailing the Russian submarine. However, each submarine lost contact with the other prior to the collision. This incident was a major political disaster for the United States, revealing that Washington was still closely monitoring Russian military activity. This event is a stark reminder of the covert operations and high-stakes maneuvers that take place beneath the ocean's surface. The Antisena-class combat boat, also known as the X-18 tank boat, is a revolutionary combat boat designed by LOM Ocean Marine and built by North Sea Boats for the Indonesian Armed Forces. This catamaran-type combat boat has a displacement of 43 tons and measures 18.75 meters in length. 
It's powered by two MTU V12 2000M86 1700 horsepower engines and two MJP 550 water jets, allowing it to reach a maximum speed of 50 knots and a cruising speed of 40 knots. The Antisena can carry a crew of 5 to 6 persons and 20 to 60 special forces or marines. Its armament includes a Cockerill 3000 series turret with a high-pressure low-recoil force 105mm gun, a 30mm cannon, and a Lemur RWS mounting 12.7mm HMG to 30mm autocannon on top of the turret. The boat is also equipped with NATO Stanak 4569 ballistic armor. The Antisena class combat boat represents a significant advancement in naval warfare technology. Ghost Drone The Evix Phoenix Ghost, also known as the Ghost Drone, is a small aerial loitering munition developed by Evix Aerospace. This drone can deliver an explosive munition to a target and can loiter over an area for up to six hours for surveillance. It's effective against medium armored ground targets and is equipped with infrared sensors for night operations. The Phoenix Ghost was developed before the 2022 Russian invasion of Ukraine and was found to be a close match for the needs of the armed forces of Ukraine in the Battle of Donbass. It was later revealed that the Phoenix Ghost was a project under the Big Safari Weapons Program. After initially sending 120 in April, it was announced in July 2022 that another 580 Phoenix Ghosts would be delivered beginning the next month as part of the Ukraine Security Assistance Initiative. This drone represents a significant advancement in military technology. The Patria Nemo is a state-of-the-art, remote-controlled 120mm mortar system that is designed for modern warfare and crisis management. Its key features include fire-on-the-move capability, a high rate of fire, excellent crew protection, and compact mobility. This system can maintain fire support while relocating, enhancing its survivability against counter-battery fire. It can execute multiple rounds simultaneous impact MRSI, fire missions where up to six grenades hit the target simultaneously. The turret and armored chassis protect the crew against ballistics, mines, IED threats, and battlefield contaminants. The light and compact turret is easily installable on light, track chassis or wheeled armored vehicles in the 6x6 6x8 by 8 class or navy vessels. The Patria Nemo is an effective tool for protecting sea lines of communication as showcased in a YouTube video. This video demonstrates its capabilities and effectiveness in real-world scenarios. Textron Ship to Shore Connector SSC is an advanced amphibious landing craft developed for the U.S. Navy and Marine Corps. This unmanned surface vehicle, with a displacement of 135 tons, measures 92 feet in length and 48 feet in beam. It's powered by four Rolls-Royce MT-7 marine gas turbine engines, enabling it to reach speeds of 35 knots at Sea State 3. The SSC is designed for endurance, capable of operating for 30 to 90 days without resupply and covering a range of 10,000 nautical miles. The SSC is the next generation of the landing craft, Air Cushion, LCAC, providing a modernized means to reach and move personnel and materials across geographically dispersed areas. It operates independent of tides, water depth, underwater obstacles, or beach gradient, showcasing the potential future of naval warfare. The world of underwater military technology is vast and fascinating. The Juliet Marine Systems Ghost is a cutting-edge warship under development for the U.S. Navy, designed to reduce friction and increase speed and maneuverability on water. Meanwhile, the Russian Navy operates mysterious ghost ships capable of underwater operations, which were present near sabotaged gas pipelines. Sunken warships from the 1940s, dubbed ghost ships, have been revealed near Japan due to underwater volcanic eruptions. These vessels lie around 1,200 kilometers south of Tokyo near the island of Iwo Jima. 
Lastly, the Ghost Shark is an autonomous robotic undersea warfare vehicle being designed in Australia for the Royal Australian Navy. These advancements represent the future of underwater military vehicles, showcasing the potential for warfare beneath the waves. Scorpion Mobile Mortar System The Scorpion Mobile Mortar System is a state-of-the-art, fully digital, automated mortar system. It's capable of firing 8 rounds in 2 minutes and can be mounted on any 1.5-ton truck. The system features a non-seating base plate, which doesn't dig into the ground, allowing for quick departure and reducing the recoil effect on the vehicle. The Scorpion can fire both 81mm and 120mm rounds, and its fire control system, FCS, can be operated from inside the cab or from outside the vehicle via a tablet. This lightweight system can even be deployed by helicopter or other aircraft, making it a significant advancement in military technology.